Hello everyone, my name is Jaybird and welcome back to Paths Taken. Now, can I do the story? Uh, yeah, go ahead. Okay. So yesterday, Chris, me, and his sister, and her kids, and whoever, just boyfriend. her boyfriend, or whatever, we all went to Panda Express. Now, I know what you're thinking. It's already a really bad idea. I know. And I thought so too. But I didn't say anything because we weren't paying for it. They were. And, um. So we're there. We're reading it. He and I both got things of, like, involving beef. We got the Beijing beef. I got the broccoli beef. And uh, it wasn't that great. So this morning, Chris wakes up, he's like, Mr. Spark, I don't feel so good. And then he got up, and before he could make it to the bathroom, he started throwing up in the hallway. Like five minutes. Uh, yeah, like for five minutes, and it was really gross, because I could hear everything, and he was making the worst sounds too. He's like, Bruh! Bruh! and I'm just like, God damn it. I mean, the worst part is, is that we had Christmas plans today because we were going to go to his grandma's to uh, have a Christmas dinner and it would be like a two and a half hour car drive there and uh, we were just like, okay, maybe he'll be fine and then he gets up, <laughs> throws up again and he's just like, yeah, we can't do it. So we had to cancel our plans. Yeah, but uh I say the bed to like nine PM. Yeah, yeah no, I have I have food poisoning too. Um not as severe. Well it's it's getting worse now. Uh I just had diarrhea and then um I, I'm getting the nause, nausea and fever from it. So <sighs> lessons are were learned today. Uh never get Panda Express. Especially right before Christmas because it's not a never good feeling no matter what they do. Yeah, some people really love it and I'm just like, what the fuck's wrong with you? Mm -hmm. uh, I, 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 I hope your your sister and, and the, the kids especially don't have food poisoning. I don't think so. They, she would have said something like that. But um, yeah. my sister has to really Sorry, they love Panda Express. Anyways, I was me neither. Not <laughs> after this experience, I already the didn't first like and it. Last time I've had Panda Express. I I already didn't like it because I've had it before and it tastes. It, it's n it, it, it's like why get Panda Express when you can just get the real thing? You know, like real Chinese food isn't that much more expensive. You know what I mean? Yeah. And it's better quality and it tastes better. And like they actually do bro beef with broccoli right, you know? You don't have it fucking dry. Cause it just. I, f I went to one restaurant before and they served it up and like the broccoli and the and the beef were like. We should probably just get the video. I know, I, I don't care about this game enough. I'm, I'm, in the, I'm in the dump. It was dry. Like the beef was dry, the broccoli was dry, there's no sauce, it was crispy and it was disgusting. It was the worst beef with broccoli I've ever had. Every other restaurant that I've ever been to always does it right, you know, with the sauce. Yeah. Jaybird, can I talk to you? Hi, our voices are not going to be as loud as Oh, wait. You look busy. Never mind then. Oh, no, it's nothing at all. I was just trying to study, but I can't seem to concentrate today. I want to talk to you about my father. Oh, okay. But, uh, the, but. Hopefully, I don't need to get up and throw up <laughs> during this video because that will be. No, I gotta make <laughs> Your father, but I thought he was. Okay, don't actually do that because that will actually make us up. <laughs> he might be. I don't. I really don't even know. Hmm? What do you mean? Well, I never really saw him. And my mother has never spoken about him either. 
Oh. I'm, I'm guessing she's a rape child. Yeah, probably. I'm sorry. But why are you telling me this? I wanted your help, actually. Well, with what? Looking for him. You want to find him? He, but he could be anywhere in this entire world. Not quite anywhere. He apparently was part of this guild in town before he... Well... I, oh, uh, I didn't know. That is why I need you to help me with this. So, will you? Um... <coughs> oh, yes, of course I will. I'd love to help you. I was hoping you'd say that. I think I know where to begin. You do? Yes, among the few things I do know about my father, I also know that he apparently gifted this to me before you left. My mother gave it to me. Is that a brooch? Oh, it's always a brooch. No, it's a brooch. No, it's a brooch. Fine, brooch. A badge, actually. As a symbol of this, this guild right here, see? So, why did he give it to you? I'm not sure. My mother said that forever she expected that I would be part of this girl too. Well, then you. I don't know, Can I just do this for the rest of the episode? I haven't really been trained in it, you see? <laughs> I was like, you see? Can I do leave the other one? Okay. And I hear they only take the best of the best, though what they do exactly is kept very secret. Uh, yes, I've heard that too. But you know, if you wish, I could help you train for swordsmanship. Perhaps one day. Thank you for offering. Don't think we were friends, aren't we? I, yes. And that is what friends do. That's not that. that no, take that fucking apostrophe out. Yes, yeah, yes, yeah. Come here right now. Oh no, I must leave, Jaybird. <laughs> <sighs> Yes, you better. I would not want you to get in trouble with my mother again. But day after tomorrow, meet me at noon. Why? We'll go look for some clues about your father, of course. Thank you. Now, I must run. <laughs> Do the Sonic run. <laughs> run. Well, day after tomorrow should be fun. Indeed. So, how long are you going to spend cooped up in this greenhouse? As long as it takes for me to plant all these crocus bulbs. You both seem to have made it your personal goal to make my task harder, however. I'll make something yeah. harder. Oh my god. It's not like that, Marco. It certainly seems like that to me. Seems like it to me. I need to get out more, you know. I know you love this garden, but you almost never leave the castle grounds. What's, what's up with that? Has it ever occurred to you that I don't want to? You fucking pussy ass bitch don't want to leave the outside. To leave the outside, to leave the outside, to leave the outside. Just go outside, read a book or something. Well, why not? The city is gorgeous, and the ledges at the outskirts are even better. I would prefer to work here, thank you very much. You pussy ass bitch. Please, Marco. Hey, you little pussy. Wouldn't it be fun to have an adventure once in a while? Hey, you little skitty cat. Look at your mom. You say that with all of the enthusiasm of a child in a sweet shop. Well, at least they're more enthusiastic than you are, you little pussy ass bitch. Adventures just don't happen. Exactly. Don't just happen. I had fun with this. And when they do, they're often dangerous. It's the only fun I get from this game. 
the only fun we have in this relationship is when it's dangerous. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Read. I love you, Deeper. Read. I'd rather stay here. No oh, pussy ass bitch. You're like SpongeBob in that one episode where Ellen is friends with his fingers and then he had a penny sing and chip. Well, we do have an adventure waiting, actually. I told you about Lucia's father, remember? You could come to the city with us and help us make inquiries. You're persistent. You're stubborn. All right. Give me a few minutes to finish up. I can't believe we convinced him. Well, we see his voice is pretty persuasive. I don't feel so good. Oh, we're in 11 minutes. Right. Is that good enough? Yeah, that's good enough. Holy shit. Okay, happy Christmas Eve, and hopefully you have a good Christmas. We are planning on doing a little something something tomorrow, but hopefully it works out. I don't know if we want to do a live stream. Is that good? Um, well, oh, you're making a sex joke, yeah, uh, no, nah, okay, but, uh, seriously, though, like, um, you want to do, like, the thing is, is, like, I kind of want to do a live stream, but I also want to have it, like, like, be up later on my channel, you know, so I Last time I did a live stream, it didn't do that. Okay, but yeah, we're gonna do a little something something for the Christmas season, cause you know, last year I did a Christmas themed game, but since it's kind of too late for, for me to find one, we're just gonna do a little bit of a reaction sort of thing. But we won't. I won't tell you what what, what we're reacting to. I just have to find out. But um, it's a pretty popular thing. Uh, any last words, partner? I love you. Who? You. Me? Yeah. Oh, no thing to say to the audience? Audience, I want you all to know that I love Jaybird. That's so sweet. I vomit. Ugh. The funny thing is, is that every time I think I'm gonna vomit, I don't, but I just burp. So, like, every time I burp, I'm just worried that it's actually gonna be vomit. I don't think you're gonna throw up. I, I think it's just gonna be all. <laughs> that to me. I don't know. I just feel very nauseous right now. And I'm just dead inside. Yeah, we're going to IHOP for Christmas. Oh, you can eat pancakes. Is that a thing? Not an IHOP. Okay, well, yeah, we're okay. Get, like a whole big stack, but probably like this big. Okay, well, let's let's wrap it up. Okay, so no more else. Do you have anything else to say? All right, guys. <sighs> Stay safe out there. I know Santa Claus is out there, and he's he's got the list already. And I would say try your best, but I I know once Santa once he puts you on that naughty list, you got no chance. And and um, really, I mean, the most I can do is um, hope that you have a good funeral, because nothing else is gonna be beautiful about the uh, Santa massacre. that being said if you guys enjoyed this episode of Path Steak and I don't know why you would if you did leave a like down below leave a comment down below share it with your friends subscribe if you haven't ring that notification bell and remember die safely bye bye it's not Christmas yet